So thank you, Chairman. Uh, uh, first, uh, 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 I'd like to uh, uh, say many thanks to Mark and so young organ uh, organizers so organizing so this good uh, conference. And so, mm, so this work is a collaboration of uh, Marshall Brown and uh, Roman Berakin and me. So uh, the leader of this project, uh, the Marshall Brown, however, so uh, this time he couldn't come to here. So uh, I explained uh, this work uh, instead of him. And so this work is uh, uh, basically based uh, uh, on the idea of great uh, Professor Suraba Berakin. So uh, Suraba is a, was a uh, supervisor of uh, Marsh Brown, and so uh, Roman is his son. And for me, Suraba uh, was a, uh, one of my best teachers and also one of my uh, best friends. So therefore, we would be very happy if we could proceed his idea. So this is one of our motivation. Okay, I will try and uh, let's start my talk. So now uh, we are interested in time-dependent Hamiltonian. So over 20 years ago, Slava did very pra practical extension of such system, extended a sy uh, dependent sy system to so stationary system. How? By introducing clock coordinate and its momentum. So now we are trying uh, to apply to his idea such a uh, following question, problem. So people want to see CCR. And this uh, operator T and A satisfy this CCR. Why? So it, this H is a Hamiltonian uh, on the uh, system. And then, so we can get some generator of the energy shift to generator of H. But so if Hamiltonian energy is shifted, so then comes question, where was it shifted? So this is one very important problem on this also the conference. But here, so there is another old problem. So this H is bounded below. So then this operator T cannot be self adjacent So therefore, this T is not observed. So how can we avoid so this situation? And how can we introduce the consistent the time operator as an observer? So we think, so answer to this question, uh, uh, Slava's idea maybe should be useful. Okay. So this is my plan you know, talk. But first, uh, I will show the idea of the extent uh, the in, uh, dependent system to stationary system uh, for Krabat idea, Krabat idea. And so, uh, uh, in classical system. And next, we quantize such extended classical system to quantum. And so this extension uh, composed of the obje uh, uh, object system and clock system. So therefore, our uh, 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 construction, in some sense, very similar to Peja and Uttas. So uh, here, uh, we discuss so relation um, to uh, our system and so Peja and Uttas. But uh, in some sense, uh, our extension uh, uh, has a correlation between the object and clock. So such interaction is, uh, can be uh, uh, shown by the using uh, the spectral decomposition of this extended Hamiltonian. So in this sense, so our uh, construction can be regarded as a, uh, in some sense, uh, extended the uh, page and Buddha. And next, uh, we will show the another construction of such extended stationary Hamiltonian, so-called quantum unitary cosine. So uh, we have, uh, we can get such 
an extended stationary Hamiltonian from two weights. And so uh, after such construction, so we applied uh, our uh, 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 stationary extended Hamiltonian to uh, damped oscillator as an example of the uh, time-dependent system. And if we have some time, so I, uh, I will comment some uh, relativity uh, con uh, consideration and conclude. So now uh, we want to close uh, the open system, namely parameterized by time t, uh, 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 namely so we uh, extend time-dependent Hamiltonian to stationary Hamiltonian. So how? So uh, the answer is by extending phase space to include a clock coordinate tau and its conjugate momentum mu. So we introduce new canonical such value. So at the same time, we also extend it for, uh, for some bracket system, including some new uh, 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 canonical uh, uh, variable, so like this. So this extension, so any time dependent uh, observable, so namely so this uh, observable f, the function q, p, and t, t is here, uh, appears so explicitly. But so uh, 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 this new uh, uh, extended system, bottom bracket system, we replace, uh, we replace this uh, uh, parameter t is new phase coordinate tau. So this tau is a function t, but uh, uh, this case, so uh, this is a slab uh, uh, construction, but his case is tau t is identity t. So we call uh, such a, a clock coordinate uh, ideal clock, ideal clock. But uh, even if such identity so in our uh, system, t is now implicit. So we have uh, the uh, 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 observable uh, 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 function of such three variables. However, but in this formulation, so in this representation now, t is implicit. OK, so uh, we extend uh, 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 stationary Hamiltonian h is given by summation of these two uh, 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 Hamiltonian. And this is object Hamiltonian replaced, replaced, replaced by the parameter t by tau. And so this mu uh, is a momentum, uh, a conjugate momentum mu. Uh, uh, but so this mu is a represent the uh, Hamiltonian of clock. But you see, in this formulation. Now, t is implicit. So therefore, this is stationary Hamiltonian. And so, uh, but in this uh, construction, so dynamics of um, original phase space, it preserved. So uh, uh, we uh, analyze the time evolution of the uh, observable A, namely, so this uh, uh, time evolution evolution is given by this uh, Poisson bracket. However, uh, due to this construction, so this Poisson bracket comes to this one. So this is just a, a dynamics of the uh, original time-independent system. Okay. But so this construction is very uh, specific construction. So now, uh, uh, the uh, time uh, uh, clock coordinate, so in general, so uh, this clock coordinate is given by the function t, and this function as a monotone function. So uh, in, uh, using so this uh, 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 general uh, clock coordinate, then our extended Hamiltonian is given by light. So here, uh, this gamma tau is a t. And so uh, this is a, a Hamiltonian of the clock. And the, the, the slower case is this is identity. And this Hamiltonian comes to the, is the same to mu. 
But so uh, in a special, like a special case, so this uh, uh, more general uh, extended Hamiltonian also still so such the uh, 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 dynamics is preserved. Uh, so this part, uh, the requirement is a, a, a additive uh, extension, namely so this expanded Hamiltonian. Uh, 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 we extend this uh, time-dependent Hamiltonian, so like additive uh, uh, construction. So uh, using construction there, uh, we can keep the original dynamics. And, um, but, uh, so in this system, uh, if an object system gain or losing energy, then crop is behaving in the same uh, 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 gain the energy and lose energy. So in this sense, this crop like an a, a environment. And so uh, the object system neither gains nor lose, uh, loss, uh, lose, it, uh, lose, uh, lose energy. But so the object and clock, each system can extend energy. So this happened if only the original object Hamiltonian depends explicitly on T. Now we uh, quantize uh, this system. Uh, uh, extend to a uh, uh, classical system to a uh, classical uh, quantum system. Okay, such quantization is on the uh, uh, composite Hilbert space, so object Hilbert space and crop Hilbert space. And here, this Hilbert uh, 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 space of crop Hilbert space is simply one, large L to R. And so uh, we extend, we quantize such a classical extended system like this. So here, uh, this is object Hamiltonian, and this is a uh, uh, Hamiltonian clock. And the QPT is a quantizing uh, observable, but this QPT uh, lives on this composite system. And the initial uh, 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 operator, for example, Q0, is uh, 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 given by uh, the uh, tensile product like this. And so this Q hat is a quantization of the uh, 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 coordinate uh, variable. And also, the, this is the time operator, and the initial uh, time operator is given by the quantized uh, uh, time coordinate, uh, time coordinate, uh, clock coordinate, right? And so both uh, such a, a operator is a multiplication operator. And also, uh, those, therefore, so P and L uh, is uh, uh, given by such con uh, contact, such conjugated uh, uh, variable. And so such a four variable satisfy the CCI uh, relation, right? And now, so you see, so uh, this uh, extended system, also the T is in this. So therefore, this is a stationary Hamiltonian. So then, uh, 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 according to this uh, 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 high level uh, 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 equation, so uh, the time revolution of QT is given by the such usual unitary evolution. And such a generator of the uh, Hamiltonian H. But now our Hamiltonian is a station. So therefore, so our Hamiltonian is stationary. So uh, our Hamiltonian can be given in terms of initially operators. So, uh, and so this, uh, uh, this expression is uh, our Hamiltonian using the spectral decomposition of the uh, operator tau. Okay, uh, so on this uh, scheme, we have the CCR, the uh, 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 Hamiltonian H, and so this operator T. So therefore, uh, now we have the CCR between H and T. However, this CCR comes from the actual CCR is uh, CCR between M and T. 
So therefore, uh, uh, fails in more general extension. But anyway, so uh, uh, due to this CCR, so uh, 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 the uh, time evolution of time operator is because uh, uh, obey this uh, differential equation. And so, namely, so that time shift uh, is given by a, 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 a okay, so that a, 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 a time operator t, a, a, a t is given by the uh, initial uh, uh, t0 plus t identity. And so uh, we construct uh, the, uh, this construction, so we may still, so H0 does not depend on time. So in such case, this MT is a station. And so HO is also a station. So therefore our extended system comes to uh, uh, this form, uh, uh, formulation. But so this formulation is very similar to the page group. Okay, uh, page and Gupta's, so their construction is uh, given by lattice. But so their uh, construction, this time operator or a clock system is constant uh, as an arbitrary part of the whole system. So namely some uh, uh, observable uh, physical system. So therefore, such a change or such a, a, a selected path system is corresponding to such change in the time uh, 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 evolution. And so uh, uh, the rest of the uh, system, uh, uh, evo uh, the evolution of the such rest of the system para parameterize such a, a selected part of the uh, uh, physical system. So like the page and Buddha, we also uh, add such uh, reality of time is given by the physical observer. So just a particle position or like a sun position. So in this way, we could identify our uh, clock coordinate operator top part with a particle position. How? So we multiply C to top part. So this C is a just constant with mass unit of speed. So therefore this um, kappa tau means the position. And so uh, the momentum is uh, divided by, a, uh, U is divided by just the constant C. So our uh, uh, mu hat is the energy. So therefore uh, 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 this new uh, operator is a uh, uh, momentum. Yeah, and so this is some uh, uh, canonical transformation uh, from tau and mu to uh, kappa tau pi tau. So using such a, 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 a canonical operator, maybe in, in the case of free particle, so uh, uh, the uh, uh, Hamiltonian of crop is a such kinetic energy. And we define uh, this observable mu hat. In this case, so we uh, we define this. We define so uh, the conjugate operator tau part like this. So this is some a uh, 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 bond time operator. And so two uh, operators satisfy so this CCR. So in this sense, uh, 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 about observing uh, uh, our uh, 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 extended Hamiltonian uh, uh, system is in some sense extension of the page and Gupta's. And we have uh, uh, our uh, system has a correlation between the observable and clock. So that interaction uh, can be uh, by uh, the spectral decomposition. So now uh, our Hamiltonian is a self adjoint operator. So therefore, uh, can be decomposed uh, by the spectral decomposition. 
So this is a such spectral decomposition, very complicated uh, uh, mathematical uh, construction, but anyway, so this one. So this is a, so this E, so the point is this. So this spectrum E, we cannot separate, oh, okay. <laughs> so uh, I have, okay, uh, uh, I have five minutes, so I rush. Uh, anyway, so, um, uh, we cannot separate so this uh, uh, spectrum two parts, namely uh, 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 object and uh, clock. So this means so two system is interaction. However, so uh, such system uh, not interaction. Then such a, a decomposition is composed by this uh, 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 like this. So in a sense, so uh, uh, our uh, uh, extended Hamiltonian, in some sense, extension of the page are with us. Okay, so I have just one, uh, 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 my time is maybe uh, almost finished. Okay, here, uh, just I will just uh, uh, brief uh, 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 explain. So this is uh, the another construction of the, our extended system. So the, the time-dependent Hamiltonian, uh, in usual way, uh, uh, so this time-dependent not generate strong, con uh, st strongly continuous one parameter group. So therefore, we analyze the cycle system. But so such usual way, so we also the, uh, reduce the our extens uh, extended Hamiltonian is the same formulation. So therefore, uh, our uh, uh, system to uh, that oscillator, and we have two approach is uh, solution of such that oscillator. Uh, uh, one is a uh, linear type approach. So this is just a uh, result. So this is a uh, uh, operator Q obeys so this uh, differential equation, and we. Uh, uh, also, uh, uh, our uh, approach is, so um, this dubbed Hamiltonian operator can be represented by stationary Hamiltonian. So therefore, we uh, apply the, our Heisenberg equation, then we can get so this uh, uh, differential equation. And then we can take partial price, the same uh, uh, differential equation. So this is uh, conclusion. So uh, uh, we uh, uh, ex we can extend stationary uh, uh, dependent time dependent system to uh, stationary system, and so we also the condensation uh, such quantum system. And so uh, actually we found uh, we can uh, get such a CCR, but so uh, this extension is not, uh, not good in general case. So therefore now we another construction of such Hamiltonian. Anyway, so uh, this uh, solve this problem, we return back here this problem. But in such case, we start from non-additive Hamiltonian, extended Hamiltonian. So then, so uh, our purpose, uh, our final goal is the two goals. So duration age of system, namely how much time passes, and another one, how quickly the time passes. So uh, in the future, uh, we want to approach uh, to analyze such a problem. So thank you so much. So this was explored in the context of, of particles, uh -huh. but also exactly looking uh, out, looking towards uh, relativity. So there, there is, one can claim there is a deep connection between taking mass as a dynamical yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, operator yeah, yeah. time. So I, I think that would then directly allow you to incorporate relativity into the construction. Yeah. 
Um, thanks for the talk. Uh, maybe I just missed it, but you mentioned the connection with um, Paige and Woods' yes. construction, but um, it seems to me there should also be some connection with the Paris clock uh, and also the work done after that by people like Ralph Silver and I guess who's there. And Michelle oh, Lewis, I think, um, maybe not in the audience, but here. Do, do, so you, you're aware of the Paris clock? I mean, it's basically so, uh, a... I, I don't know. So I'm not okay. Yes. okay, so then we should discuss it afterwards, I guess. Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Thank you very much again.